Hello and welcome to episode 13 of The Buck Stops Here, my Football Manager Mobile 18 save with Telford United. In this episode we'll be reviewing the uh, final five games of the season in the month of March. Uh, we're going to see if we can reach the 100 point mark and uh, also we'll have a quick season review as well. So uh, let's jump straight into the episode. So uh, in the uh, month of Apologies, it's not the month of March at all, it's the month of April, because of course uh, in February we secured our playoff spot, in March uh, we won the title. Uh, so April, yes, uh, we started with a 4-0 win against Leamington, followed up with a 2-0 win uh, against Chorley, a 2-1 win away at Stockport, before uh, we rounded out our home campaign with a 1-0 loss against Gainsborough, and finished the season with a 3-0 draw at Boston. So let's take a look at the games in slightly more detail. We'll start with the Leamington game, with it being the first. Uh, Jack Sparks opened the scoring. Uh, Chicane Steele went off injured. Callum Gittings uh, joined him in going off injured in the second half. Uh, a brace from Matthew Barnes Homer uh, in the first half gets 3 0 lead at half time, and uh, John Marsden rounded the scoring off uh, in the 75th minute. Uh, in terms of player ratings, uh, Plenty of good ratings, but uh, perhaps unsurprisingly, the brace from Matthew Barnes Homer enough to win him man of the match. Uh, heavily rotated squad, as you can see, that due to the fact that that was our, our second game in uh, three days uh, over the Easter period. Uh, then uh, two nil game, uh, two nil victory against Chorley. Uh, perhaps back to our, our more usual lineup. Um, yep, so. Uh, an own goal, and then three minutes later, a strike from Owen Jones was uh, enough to give us all three points in a game that, as the stats show, was uh, pretty low on, on excitement. A uh, total of five shots uh, from both teams. So, uh, not the most entertaining of uh, fair, but uh, three more points uh, for us. Take a look at the player ratings. Uh, Owen Jones and Jack Sparks, two players who are standing out for ourselves, with Matthew Hughes standing out for the visitors. Uh, Jones winning man of the match, thanks to uh, his strike. Moving on, it was then a uh, trip to Stockport and a 2-1 win. Uh, Jack Sparks opened the scoring for us. Uh, Tyron Afori in the 70th minute uh, gave us a 2-0 lead. Uh, Ten minutes before time, uh, Matthew Warburton pulled one back, but that was as good as it got for Stockport as we uh, ran, out visit uh, ran out victors uh, there. Uh, take a look, player ratings, Ofori man of the match uh, with his goal. Uh, and, and perhaps a bit more what we're used to seeing, so sort of a few eights and plenty of sevens dotted around in there. Final home game of the season, uh, at home to Gainsborough, and uh, we lost 1-0. Um, they scored three minutes into the game, and yeah, we, well, we had seven chances, but there wasn't anything um, sort of particularly great about what we did. Um, just another one of those strange games where, um, yeah, it didn't seem to matter what we did. We could have stayed out there for twice the amount of time and still wouldn't have scored. Uh, Simmons gets man of the match for his goal. Um, as you can see, we only had a couple of eights and five from Henry Cowens as well. Um, and nobody from the bench able to make any impact either. Final game of the season, away against second place Boston. Uh, for a good um, two thirds of the season, uh, they ran us, and then then we sort of pulled away. Uh, nice bit of symmetry, really, as we started the campaign with a three-three draw away from home and finished the season with a three-three draw away from home. Uh, again, we've gone two 0 down. So uh, Maguire and Vince put them two up in the uh, first half. Uh, I know team talks aren't a feature of this, but certainly I'd have given the, uh, the lads a um, Peace of my mind at half time, I think it's fairly safe to say, and uh, evidently it uh, would have paid off as uh, 29 seconds into the second half, Marsden pulled one back. Owen Jones leveled the score in the 59th minute. Uh, Shimanga put Boston back into the lead with 14 minutes to go, and deep into stoppage time, basically the last kick of the game. A uh, corner came in, and, and Clifton ended up turning it into his own net in a, a thoroughly entertaining match. Uh, let's just take a look at the ratings. Owen Jones, man of the match, uh, but plenty of uh, good ratings dotted around there as well. Uh, so, uh, 
let's just take a little look at the league table then. And yes, we broke the 100-point uh, barrier, 103 points we finished the season with, um, which was very pleasing. And as you can see from there, Boston finished second. And in fact, uh, they won the playoffs, beating uh, Southwood 4-0 in the uh, playoff final. Uh, just take a quick look. So at home, we picked up 50 points, uh, three losses. Uh, and away from home, we were unbeaten all season. Uh, which is uh, pretty impressive, I, I would say, uh, and I actually picked up three more points away from home than we did at home. Uh, overall, 95 goals scored, um, uh, only 32 conceded. So let's just take a look at some player stats. Uh, so we have the two top leading goal scorers with O'Foury and Marsden. Owen Jones coming in uh, seventh with uh, 16 goals. Let's see what else the average rating. Uh, Owen Jones rating of eight, joint highest with a launcher of Boston, but a, a four in Marsden uh, were also reasonably close behind with 7.76 and 7.68 respectively. Uh, most assists, uh, Marsden with 14, Jones with 12, uh, Michaela and Afori with 10 apiece, so uh, plenty of assists showing up there. Uh, red cards, I'm pleased to say that we haven't got anybody there we can see obviously we could scroll down uh, but nobody up there towards the top yellow cards uh, Jordan Lussie 15 uh, joint second with uh, Atkinson in terms of the number but uh, Williams of Alfreton leading the way uh, player of the match Owen Jones with 12 Afori with 10 Marsden with 9 that's uh, the top 3 uh, in the division so obviously uh, a sign of just how consistent they've been uh, appearances um, yeah don't really know why I've taken a look on that one because 42 is the most you could have without going through the playoffs. Uh, and conceded, Jasper is seeing 14, but he probably only played about a third of the season at the most, I would have thought. Master with only uh, 18, so very impressive there. Um, some bad news on the transfer front. Uh, Owen Jones will be leaving us. He's going to be joining Bristol City for a fee of £55,000. Uh, obviously the money's welcome, but he's been a pretty key player for us and he, he's going to be um, quite tricky to replace. That concludes um, episode 13, so we've uh, had that review of, of April and also of the season. Uh, join us for the next episode where we'll be reflecting on pre-season prior to us beginning our first campaign in the National League. Hope you've enjoyed the episode and hope to see you back for the next episode as well.